Hello, everyone. Welcome to a look at my top five episodes of Adventures of the Gummy Bears. As a huge fan of the classic 80s animated series, I'm excited to take a nostalgic trip to revisit some of the most iconic episodes of the show. Whether you're a longtime fan or just discovering the series for the first time, let's celebrate the best of Adventures of the Gummy Bears. Because the show aired in different orders internationally, I'll be using how the show currently appears on Disney Plus for the season and episode numbers. So without further ado, let's begin with number five, a gummy by any other name. Our number five spot goes to the episode where Kala finds out about the gummies. She and Sunny are both frustrated by their responsibilities and lack of friends. Zummy creates a hat that has the power to change the appearance of the wearer to whoever's name they say. This episode takes the classic Prince and the Pauper story and mixes it up with magic. There are a lot of fun moments where one character is pretending to be another, culminating in Princess Kala doing her best Duke Igthorn impression. The importance of the episode is undeniable considering how often Kala knowing about the gummies and her friendship with Sunny are pivotal plot points in the future. Number 4, The White Knight The number 4 spot goes to this episode where the White Knight returns to Dunwin with many good deeds to his name. We discover the White Knight has a secret though, he is actually Igthorn's brother. He goes to great lengths to hide this fact but Igthorn threatens to out him. The White Knight eventually realizes that it's better to be honest and let people judge for themselves. The kingdom is shocked, but cannot deny his good deeds and decide to judge him for his character, not his kin. It's a nice commentary on being true to yourself and how your family doesn't have to define you. Number three, just a tad smarter. At number three, we have the episode where we meet Toadie's cousin, Tadpole. After being caught and released by the Gummy Bears, Tadpole vows vengeance. He shows up in Dreckmore and rallies the ogres against Duke Igthorn's nasty behavior. When they oust the Duke, Tadpole changes and becomes even more nasty than the Duke ever was. He also orders the destruction of all Gummy Berry bushes. To save their berry supply, the gummies team up with Igthorn himself to take down Tadpole. I love when a show subverts expectations like this, where characters who are always enemies find themselves on the same side. I like the political commentary of this episode, while also exploring the concept of the enemy of my enemy is my friend. It's also pretty funny that the ogres mildly care about having to clean a courtyard with their tongues, but the last straw for them is taking baths and wearing flowers. Number two, King Igthorn, parts one and two. Our number two slot goes to multiple episodes, as we have the only two-parter in the series. In some areas, King Igthorn was the two-part finale of the whole series, but here in the States, there were a few episodes that aired after it. The epic storyline sees one of Duke Igthorn's plans actually working. He manages to destroy the Gummy's home, steal the Great Book, create a Gummy Berry Juice Factory, and take over Dunwin, all in part one. We see all of our favorite characters get in on the action to save the kingdom in part two. It definitely has a series finale feel, even including a sword fight between Igthorn and King Gregor. This feels like the most comprehensive of the storylines in the show, a true adventure and battle between good and evil, definitely earning its place near the top of this list. Honorable Mentions There are so many great episodes of this show. Here are a few that are great but didn't quite make my list. Light Makes Right an episode that reveals a lot of history of the gummy bears and introduces the gummy scope, which is used multiple times throughout the series. The Knights of Gummadoon, a mysterious gummy city that only appears once every 100 years. Any theater kid will appreciate this take on the classic musical Brigadoon. 
Return to Ursalia. This episode sees the gummy lore fleshed out with the introduction of gummies from the Barbic Woods, who act and think very differently from our heroes in Gummy Glen. Finally, number one, what you see is me. Now we have my absolute favorite episode of the Gummy Bears, where we meet Trina, a blind woman who lives alone in a cottage. Tummy jumps in her window to hide from ogres and meets Trina and her dog Watcher. Tummy makes assumptions based on her condition and tries to do everything for her. Trina quickly shows she is more than capable of taking care of herself and even helps Tummy thwart Igthorn and his goons in classic Home Alone style. This episode makes the top of my list because it is one of the few I still remembered from watching as a kid. It literally made an impact on me and how I viewed people who were differently abled than myself. A lesson still is relevant 37 years later. Besides, I identified so much with Tummy, he had to be the star of my number one pick. And there you have it. I hope you enjoyed revisiting some of the most iconic moments from this classic cartoon series. It's amazing to think that even after all these years, the show still holds a special place in the hearts of so many of us. Do you agree with my ranking? Are there any episodes you think should have been included? Let me know in the comments. Also tell me what 80s and 90s shows you'd like to see me cover in the future. Thank you for joining me on this journey. If you'd like a more overall look at the history of the Gummy Bears, check out my Remember the Gummy Bears video. And until next time, keep on bouncing. It's the Gummy Way.